This is Hanoi, Vietnam, May 17, 2017. This is the Red River. This is the Coming Red River. Coming down here. Okay. This stream is the division between China and Vietnam at this point. Oh, so we're looking at China on the other side. So okay. China is there, Vietnam is there, and we're in Vietnam here. And the border goes up I the Red see. River for 100 kilometers. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, so this is some Vietnamese slate on, the, on these dumps. Okay, we're up here on a mountaintop, very far north of Vietnam, up near the China border. We're at a standstill. I just walked quite a ways up this hill to find out what the problem is. I don't know what this is, but this kind of looks like the problem here. I'm guessing this truck is broke down on the road here. This tractor trailer broke down, it's blocking most of the road. Nobody can go up. There's barely room for them to come down. Trying to get them through and there comes a bus. Oh! Made it. Okay, this is Lai Cao, Vietnam, way up in the north. Uh, near the Chinese border, May, I think it's the 19th, 2017. This is just a side street. I'm just buying some French pastries here, sort of coconut things that are really good. We're actually having lunch up here somewhere. I'm going to head up there. But this is just uh, what it looks like here uh, in Vietnam. There's the road on the street I'm on. It's very it's been very rainy. Been here. This is our second day in this town. We're going up to Slate Quarry uh, shortly. Lai Chow Slate Quarry. Or Lai Chow Stone is the name of the company. We've arrived at the uh, Lai Chow Stone Company. I'm gonna go down there and take a look at the uh, Slate Stockyard. This is the camp area where people sleep and they cook food and stockpile the slate. Uh, I don't know what's in here. Just, uh, yeah, see. Sleeping quarters for workers. I assume these are all the same here. Here's an administrative office there. Uh, these things along here, there's a chicken house, a duck house, different animal houses. Here we go with a hard hat. This is the owner, Chris Kernell from Australia, lives here in Vietnam. This is a Ryan Jenkins. What, what's the name of this river, Chris? This is Nap Na, N A M N A. Napna River. And, yeah. and is that still Vietnam on the other side? Yeah, yeah. What's this here? This comes from this Grey Slate quarry about 50 kilometers away. Oh, this is from Vietnam, Vietnamese also. It's, yeah. It's yeah. 50 kilometers. I can get this stuff out of China, but it's not as blue. This is a nice, uh, very dark, black, smooth, fine grained. There's, there's 3222s, 3020s, and 2718s in here, and they haven't labeled it for me, uh, which is destined for <coughs> France, which is better than the rest of the stuff. Hmm. It's very hot and humid, it's been raining for days. Okay, we cross the river on the boat. We're gonna walk up, I guess a few hundred, hundred meters or so to the mill area. Okay, we made it to the quarry. 
is the rock face. The guys are taking it out. Uh, this is the mill area up here. Now we're at the mill. Okay, here's kind of an overview. This is the river down here. And the other side is the uh, camp, kitchen, uh, overnight accommodations. This is the mill. This is just a uh, little room for tea and whatnot. Underneath me, down here, is the rock face where they're getting the slate out. They pull it out in this truck. They take it down to the boat. Well, they take the, they mill it here, and then they take the finished slate down to the boat that we came across on, I believe, and then uh, that's how it gets to the other side. Gets palleted up, it's shipped off. <clears throat> Currently, it's not really being shipped to the U.S., but it is being shipped around. It's been, a lot of it's being used in Vietnam, and it's also being shipped to other nations. Uh, Chris would like to ship it to France and some European countries, etc. It's a very nice, clear-grained, unfading black slate. Here's a little village in northern Vietnam. The cicadas are almost deafening. It's uh, the sun is going down. Nearly sunset. I was trying to get the sound of the cicadas. So we went to the quarry, we're on our way back. And here we are, 